Hello, I hope I'm in focus. Um, I'm moving in exactly one week from today. One week from today, I'll be on my way back to New Brunswick, waiting until I move to Ontario, most likely the capital, Ottawa. However, if plans change, going straight to Toronto. So, not sure what you can see. Um, it's really echoey. My roommate moved out today, so we have like no furniture. Um, yeah, our upstairs neighbors took it. My furniture and stuff still here. You're on my little shelves. I just realized I never really did an apartment tour, and I was so excited to move into this place almost a year ago. But it has been a year. That is for a different video. I just got back from Walmart. Excuse my hair. Exam weeks. I have one left. And um, picked up two more of these. I have so many of these already. Um, various sizes in my bedroom, which is a big hot mess. So it is what time? 3.38 p.m. And yeah, I want to mop the floors and bring out everything in here, sort through what I'm keeping. And I need to take photos of the furniture. I'm selling, which is basically all of it that is mine, and um, I need it gone. It's a great day. I found my Christmas card from my uncle, which has a $100 Walmart gift card in it, so God bless for that. I also found a grocery store gift, grocery store gift card, which is awesome because I also don't have money right now. waiting for my tax returns, um, and yeah, that is... Uh, Let's start packing somehow. Slight problem. I didn't realize all of this fit in there. Um, and I have a whole room to pack in this and sorry using my big DSLR not used to vlogging on this um, ignore the mess but as you can see I have all of this and this so yes I realize I have too much stuff but I need it like I've accumulated a lot I'm literally moving a whole house so, love the struggle life. Who is waiting outside my house? Two. Oh, okay. Why do I always look ugly in my vlogs? I swear I normally look better, but yeah. I think the plan is, I actually I don't know. So basically I have an entire spare room right now for a week and in here, but I still have to mop and clean up a bit. Um, we had to fix the wall, so yeah. There's all that, and yeah, that's not my stuff, so less stuff for me to have to move. And then this room, I said I clean. Basically, this is our junk room, so everything that we don't want or anything kind of just winds up in here, so I have to go through trash everything, and yeah. I don't know if I should move all of my packed boxes in here just because it's empty. It's really nice. Maybe, well, I have an exam. So when my exams are over, maybe I will film more videos while I can in this very nice, clean, bright apartment. So yeah, watch me struggle moving all these boxes. <laughs> more stuff than I thought so six suitcases there's still some room and some of them to add you know clothes I'm gonna be wearing for the next week two bins of coat hangers bags of shoes five of these things I really need to go through these and see if that's really 
what I want to keep just because it's just I have a lot and I mean I don't know how I'm going to fit this. Um, my aunt and mom are both bringing their cars up so that means we'll have three cars. Um, but even then I feel like I need a literal U-Haul. But if I was renting a U-Haul I'd bring all my furniture and I'm selling it. So, And when I get to my mom's house I literally have no furniture. I have a bed and I'm bringing a bookshelf and my cube organizer. That's about it. I'm selling everything else. So, uh, I have slotted like three times in the past year. Um, it is destroyed, so I'm gonna help my mom work on home improvement updates just because one of my favorite things to do. I'm gonna be looking for a job, but I'm probably not gonna have one. So, I'll have time. And I had a dresser that my parents bought me when I was like a baby. And that didn't die in the flood, so I think I'm going to sand it, paint it white. It's not like my IKEA dresser, but it'll do. Might get rose gold um, hardware to, or like diamonds or something just to make it cute. So then I'll have a dresser. Thank God. Don't have a closet. I think I'm going to have to buy an armoire. I also move bedrooms, so I literally have the smallest room in the house. is actually the office, but it just made sense. Like I don't live there. I'm only going to be there for four months. And um, my mom did say I could probably have my old bedroom back, like the master bedroom that she has. I don't want to do that because like, I like being above ground. The master bedroom is not above ground. So we'll see though if I feel like I want more space and privacy. Um, so yeah, like I said, not really sure what I'm doing this summer. I just know I'm going home. I know I have way too much stuff. So I think I'm gonna have to go through all the bins. My plan was just to like pack as much as I could, but I think I need to go through realistically, see what I can sell, see what I can donate, see what I can trash. So yeah, that room back there where you where you watch me struggle move everything to, I think that room will just be um my head's probably been cut off for most of that. I think that room will just be like you know, a sorting organizing room. Um, I'll have to go through the bins. I think my friend's gonna come and help me just because this is like pretty freaking overwhelming. And like, I don't want to do this stuff. I have a week. Um, never thought I was actually gonna move. <laughs> Definitely didn't think I was gonna be moving 20 hours away either. So, we gotta crack down and figure things out. And I need to also, I don't want to go grocery shopping, but I have like no liquid, so I need to get water so I don't die of dehydration, and I'm sorry this whole video is a rant, so let's uh, take down some decorations and go from there. <laughs> also, in my car I have three massive bags of things I've accumulated in five different offices in four different years. Um, so yeah, I have to go through that too. I try to do it there, but it's just hard. Like I'm a very, I have a hoarder personality, but I'm just like nostalgic. I watched Marie Kondra's series, so hopefully that will help me. But yeah, we're gonna take off the, the wall art. These have been in all of my apartments, dorm rooms since I moved here. Uh, I can just throw those out it was for a birthday, but they look cute. And that, when I was editor of my paper, this was my first ever article. So, yeah, I framed it, obviously. And then I'll go through these bins. It's mostly photo albums and candles and my Apple TV. And underneath of it is DVDs. And I don't even watch DVDs. But I took them from my mom's house when I moved here because I never thought I'd be moving home. So that's a joke, but that's also a video for a different day. <laughs> Just gotta scrape off some blue things. This is looking more empty now. That's good. Also, I have to shower and get ready because I'm going on an ice cream date with my best friends tonight because, like I said, one week left and it's a lot. So, next I have to tackle this fucking monstrosity of literally packages we receive. All of these actually expired, so I'm gonna do a fun video and melt them all. This is all is good makeup. Why do I own so many trees? So yeah, most of this room's actually trash, but I actually have to get around and trash it. That was probably a terrible angle. So I have to send out cards today to 
the littles. So we'll probably do that today. I'll probably do that Tuesday for Easter. It'll be late, but it's okay if I remember. And yeah, man, man oh man. I gotta stop moving. I've literally moved. I'm just gonna touch on this briefly, but I think I'm gonna have a whole separate video on this. I grew up in the same house, didn't move, moved bedrooms three times. That was about it. Biggest change was moving a bedroom. And then I moved how many times? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I moved seven times in two and a half years. And then I've been here for about a year. Um, so I'll be, I'll have moved eight times in almost, in three and a half years, so almost four years, eight times, actually in four years it'll be nine because I will be moving again in August unless I get a job in like Toronto or Ottawa that I applied for before I applied for grad school, um, but I like fingers crossed praying to the gods, like law of attraction, positive energy into the universe, whatever. I hope I get into grad school. So I'm gonna move up mid-August, maybe even August 1st, I don't know. Um, just cause I wanna be settled, new city, big city, can't wait. Um, so I'll be moving again. So nine times in four years <laughs> is a lot. And then I know once I get to Ottawa, wherever I move first, I wanna try and stay there, but I don't know because one, I don't know where I'm gonna live in Ottawa. Two, I don't know if I'm gonna live in Ottawa or Toronto, and I just feel like I'm still going to be constantly moving. So, it's time to declutter now. I'm also procrastinating. I have probably my biggest exam left to do of my undergrad. And yeah, I have so, so much I gotta do. And tackling that room and putting up all the furniture I wanna sell, it should be the number one of my priority and then figuring out what to do with all these pots and pans because I have a lot and I wish I could have a yard sale maybe I'll just kajiji and be like take all my pots and pans I feel like if I just take stuff out of the cart that I know I'm gonna keep like I have like my palettes that I don't want to throw out and like my good lip products but I honestly should go through because I can probably massively declutter these too like that's old that's old actually I can probably get rid of a lot of this so we can do that I guess I'm also tired this is just a fucking disaster um pardon my language so then we have our recyclables in here. I'm throwing out these pillows. So I'll just wash the cases, I guess. Um, tree. Madison forgot her printer box. I'll throw that out. More recyclables. Bags. I forgot our water hamper. Fan. Halloween sign. Broken lamp that I can just throw out. My grad shoes. Even though I guess they'd match my grad dress. I got these at Payless before Payless closed. Look how pretty. Oh, love. And they're a wedge because I have flat feet, so heels are very hard for me. Okay, right, now I can show you my room. I know it looks like a complete, utter disaster, but it's because I threw, like, pretty much all my stuff in here. Um, it's actually organized chaos, so all the clothes there are clean. Those I'm keeping. I have trash bags in the corner of, like, bedding and clothes that I had, like, rips in them. I had to get rid of them. Um, bags over there ready to pack things. So, like, yes, it looks bad. And my grandmother, if she was alive, will be having a fit that I just showed the internet. My terrible room. But, yeah, um, we're working on it. So, gotta start somewhere. Am I right? So, yeah. I'm just really procrastinating want to find the best angle. Should I film a makeup declutter video? Let me know. I have an update. I'm sorry that I'm showing mostly just me ranting about packing and cleaning than me showing you do it, but that's going to change. Um, so in the spare room where I had like my beauty and office stuff, this is all my hair, body stuff. I'm really into hair and beauty. Um, and this is all my makeup and I was going to do a declutter But I don't really know where my channel is going So I guess I could have done it because like everyone's just doing what they want now on YouTube It's been a few years since I've been 
up on my game. Um, but yeah, so I have all that done. Um, it still looks like a mess, but I, I understand what I'm doing now, if that makes sense. It's just actually doing it. Um, today's my off day just because I wrote an exam yesterday and I'm just wiped from it. And um, yeah, so I'm putting more decorations and kitchen stuff in here. That's still a mess. And then I sort of threw my mug, so I'm choosing this half and gonna donate that half. So that's doing well. Food, I have to eat, whatever I don't eat, I'm just gonna donate and then get rid of all that up there too. And I don't wanna deal with <laughs> the kitchen. I'm gonna get rid of the kettle just cause I've had it a while and it was like 10 bucks and I don't know if it really works anymore. So there's that and then on here I have like trash stuff but also like birthday stuff. So got cups and paper straws. Um, my roommate left her milkshake straws. Um, you know then my friend left her stuff here and another candle so yeah get in there get in there i'm about to clear out here mop everything in here and put the furniture that i'm going to sell in here once i've wiped it down gotta call the internet people and tell them to turn it off trash it i don't know it's just a lot for one person but honestly like i suck at packing and normally my aunt packs for me. But I think I'm doing really good because it's a week. I normally pack the night before, the morning of that I move. And I typically, or one time, I had four hours to move because I had to move apartments. Um, like in four hours because my old landlord is like, if you're moving, you have four hours. So basically, yeah. <sighs> got all that, got all that. And then the room, like I have so much stuff, I'm really not sure how it's gonna fit. I know I have three cars and I'm bringing my headboard, my cube organizer and my bookshelf. I'm kind of thinking maybe I should sell the bookshelf and just buy a new one, but we'll see, but yeah. It's a lot of freaking stuff. How does one person own this much stuff? Although for a whole house, I think it's good. Yeah, I just really have to, I think when my friends come to help, we're gonna reopen these, cause some of these I packed like actually a week ago. And um, we're gonna see what I actually need. I went through all of this and like I actually need and want all of this. Um, I do a lot of face masks, travel a lot, stocked up on toothpaste, it's just, yeah. So that's just a little update. My suitcases where my rest of my clothes will go. And yes, getting there, getting there. I'm getting tired, I didn't sleep last night. I haven't been sleeping well in general in a while. I really just wanna eat a vegetable tray. Um, Got a shower, but yeah, let's uh, clean the spare room. This is dying. I just got a text. Oh, my um, BFF is actually coming into town this weekend, so I'm excited. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna quickly clean up here. I'll do a little montage of me cleaning, charge the camera because it's dying, and uh, get a show on the road. So I just did a quick mop. It's just about five now. So I'm just going to um, relax, get ready, shower. Gonna go get ice cream with a friend. Like I said, I'll probably bring you along. Yeah, I'm gonna do like a much better job of cleaning like right before I move, but this is just, you know, like a normal mopping. I just have no furniture because we're getting ready to move. So yeah, looking nice and shiny. I'll let that dry. And then, like I said, I'm gonna get ready. Um, and yeah, I yeah, I just look at everything else I have to do and I panic, but I think I'm doing good for what I have. The camera died, so I'm gonna stop talking. And yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video where hopefully I'm not this much of a mess. Bye guys.